It's Extra Gaming here, and welcome back to our butt. Here we go. Today is going to be more of like a tricks video, like telling you how to do stuff. So, how to turn on the fabricator. I know a lot of people are going to struggle with this on PS4. Because it's actually pretty hard to find it on the internet. That's why I'm making this video specifically called how to power the fabricator. So what you're gonna do is, you're gonna make gasoline. That's how you're gonna power this. But how do you make gasoline? Because you can't make the generator, or the wires, or any part without the fabricator. And how are you supposed to run that? So what you actually do is, yes, I've upgraded my base quite a lot. Like, I've gone up the mountains, I've got a house over there. I've upgraded quite a lot in the last video. But, um, so what we're gonna, what we're gonna do is, you're gonna go to a refinery forge over here. This one I just have very little stuff in. I've been cooking a lot of metal to get the industrial refinery forge, which I very much advise y'all to, if y'all want to, get the industrial refinery forge after I show you this video. Put your harvesting amount to 14. Get all that metal. Take a stego. Take a bronto. Take something with a lot of weight and a lot of things. Like an Argentavis, go up a mountain, look for, I should have a rock near me that looks like it. Look for a rock that looks like, like these right here. These are special rocks. Look, all right, so in the middle, like the bottom left, look up a little. Or, no, it's like the middle left. See how much metal I'm getting? That's from this one. But I do not need all of this. So, sadly, I'm gonna throw... I'll keep a 200 of metal. Never a bad thing. But yeah, so, turn your thing to 14. Mine that. Get a bunch. And a bunch. And a bunch of chitin or carotene chitin you get from scorpions which as you can see i have a lot not even clip me enough for that <sighs> so i'll show you in a minute what it takes to get the industrial refinery report but so what you gotta do is i'm gonna get the stuff i don't want to use much but you know how you can put in a refinery forge only certain things that it tells you you can put in. Well, but let's go over here. Do I have hide in here? Yes, I do. So you take oil and hide. I think I actually have some oil in here. Nope. So you go over to your refinery forge, throw your wood in, throw your, see the oil goes in, throw your hide in there, you cook, you wait a second, and while that's cooking, I'm gonna come over here. This right here is the industrial refinery forge. I'm not gonna say it's gonna take two minutes. It's gonna take like two months to get this and that's not an exaggeration it took my my friends both of them and one of them works a lot longer like he'll stay on it for so long so this right here the industrial forge it cooks 20 metal every I think 
10 seconds, yeah. Cook 20 metal every 10 to 20 seconds, I think. And it's so big. Their house, yeah. their house, their roof. It's, it's smaller than mine. Mine's barely gonna fit. Mine, because, because of these boxes and that chimney, it's not going to fit. Unless I'm, I might could stick it over here. It's so big. You might think it's gonna be like one of these size. No, it's huge. It's like the size of my ceiling. It's so big. So, um, that's, and here's the, um, things you need. You need 2,500 metal, 250 crystal, which you can get from, I think, any mountain. I chose this mountain just because there's crystal at the top, there's a bunch of metal rocks, over there's some obsidian. I've got pretty much everything I need, and when it rains, I get um water so i don't really have to make trips trips to the beach all right and then so let's put out that fire thing i forgot i need two oil i don't want to use much oil because i'm saving up for 400 and i'll go get it like i i know where some oil is So let's watch. And just to show you that nothing else is cooking it. There. Took out the charcoal. So it's not like oil and charcoal or hide and charcoal and I'm just making this up. It's only oil and hide. Go out for a minute. Give it a second. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, one. I'm gonna throw this stuff in here first. All right. Do I still not have how much longer does this have to cook? Maybe I don't have enough oil. I I'm about to go on an oil run to one. I'll take the three. Three, just in case. Just in case. <coughs> Let's give that a minute. I don't know why it's not working right now. It will in a minute. I have a lot of gas in the proof it. Um, dehydrated brain, please, because I don't have a bird right now. I can fly me on over. Uh, but I could use my water jar again. <sighs> Trying to look for all the gasoline I have. Where's all the gasoline? Ah, uh, here it is. 50 gasoline. I'll make throw this in here. Oh, and this is not the only cabinet I have full of fiber. I have two cabinets full of fiber. This one right here. All that fiber. I think there's some fiber. No, oh, there's not that I think there is some fiber in here. Nope, oh, and it's over there. Nope, alright, I have no clue where it is. So I'm just hoping for rain now. But that should be long enough, correct? See? Gasoline. So that's how you make gasoline. And all you've got to do, you come in here, you take the gasoline you had, put it in, 
turn on. Did she make that noise? There was some obsidian, some metal, some silic pearls, like. Alright. This is just gonna be a video pretty much. I gotta go to the ocean anyway. Pyrobites and leeches are the only way you can get silic pearls to sell under water And to be honest, who wants to go looking for underwater caves? No one, because it takes too much time. They just want to search the surface of the water and kill a bunch of tribes, or if they're near a swamp, just set up the swamp, wait for a leech to try and come and eat him, and then shoot it in his thumb, blood-sucking face. And then get some silic pearls. It's, everybody wants to do that. Like, you get to kill something, and you get something out of it. Very useful. So, like, who wanted to do that? Oh, and by the way, in the new up released update, there is a new dinosaur called the Uranosaurus. Stay far away from it. It is in the Arctic areas. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. I do not want to get in a fight right now. That's a scorpion. I can save whatever. Oh, it's a patchy. It's a patchy. Yeah, I like patchy. Isn't it Guande? Hi, Guande. I just can't die right now, pretty much. I'm low on stamina. I'm about to pass out. I'm very close to passing out. Ah, oh, my bird died. How did my bird die? Enough stuff on my tail. Ah, oh. oh, something's eating that. Meat. Oh, it's a little. Yeah, that, that thing's fine. They don't attack. Eh, cool. Hey, now I know how to tame one. I might tame one. Just to have it. Just to, ha like, have all the animals. <laughs> Just to have a wide variety of animals. I need more solid pearls. I just do. Mm. Oh gosh, really? I am right at the beach. There's a bunch of different sources that are coming to eat my face off. There's a bunch of dodos. Hope they go for the dodos first. I can save the dodos. I can kill the dodos and kill the dippos. I don't care. I just need to get to the water and back to my old base over there. And I'm going to show you how to get silver pearls and oil. If you don't know how to get oil. Which it's pretty obvious how you get oil, but just in case. Like, you're new to the game and you have no idea what oil is pretty much yet and what it's used for. And you're new to this channel. Dang it. But what you want to do for trilobites, you want to get underwater, and what you want to do is you want to stay very close to like, if there's a slant, you can try and go down it. This, you might get try and go down this, there might be some down there, but not only do you want to stay up here, where you can get air immediately, pretty much. They like to crawl. They do not swim. They don't swim like coal. Or coal, however you want to say them. They move like... 
like a centipede. They're an underwater centipede. So, they have to stay along the, like, coast. Or, like, they have to stay on the ground. And they can't go to the bottom of the ocean. Like, I guess they could, but they'd have to stick to a wall. Cause that, you're gonna hit a steep slant down. You just are. There's my house I've been showing. There's a coal. I don't know what you call it yet. Coal or coal. Cool or cool. Leave in the comments what what you think. And click that bell button down below so you can keep up with my videos and know when I'm going on. I did see an Alpha T Rex back there. Luckily, I dropped off some oil down here. Where's the oil? Oil. Yay. But the thing is, it's not my fault. Yep, I'm a normal person. I just carry um, 1,033 plant on me at all times. No big deal. Alright, so the oil is not far down at all. I think it's over in that area over there. Dang it, I don't know. It's that, so I don't know. I don't know. Oh, and now you have skin so a little bartender with a ponytail and for a mustache and there to go. I saw oil so close to the What you gonna do when you get so close to the beach and they like coming up on shore? Is what you're gonna do is you're gonna back up on shore and look down into the water as you can see it's clear until you get submerged. And then, as you can see, I'm by that's a that's a um, sarcasm. And it's dead. Give it, give it. Pardon me, roll me. Uh -huh. Don't need it any of that. Take it all back. Actually, it kind of needs me to roll me. Just at this pace. I don't need to roll me at any rates. I'm looking for leeches. If I can get leeches, because this is a swamp after all. I can get leeches after me, that would be amazing. I don't know why leeches don't go after me anymore. It's weird. Like, I'll come into the water. Oh gosh, never mind. When you're going leech hunting, you've got to be very careful. 
I'll get this leech off me in a second. That's, oh, that's cool. That scared the heck out of me. I think I just had a heart attack. Oh, God, why? Where the heck are these switches? What? Why the heck? A titan boa. I'll get these leeches off of me in a second. I'm killing that titan boa. I just named it. Nah, I guess. Who the heck is that titan boa? Where the heck is Big Best Buy? Get the stupid leeches off me in a second. Leeches! I killed a leech? Finally! Which one gives me more? That gives me 40. That gives me one. I guess I'm uh, I need eight. Alright, got enough. If only you could, when you burn them, like you can burn them, that's how you get these off actually. You'll come over to a campfire, you'll light the campfire, and you'll hop on it. It'll kill all the leeches. Well, there you go. Kill all the leeches. Is that the fire? No more leeches. Bam. Oh, time for a little more silic pearls. Because I have no clue why. I'm like, never. Another leech. Hey, leech. Hey, leech. I'm just gonna do it. And I don't because you're dead. I've never seen this much action with leeches on the beach. Oh my gosh, this is a big day. I came here for some triobites because triobites like give you more. Or maybe some leeches. But I expected to like kill them in the water. Sorry if my voice is uh, like. My, I'm losing my voice. I've had strep for the past two days, and I today it's been clearing up, but I still have a little ways to go. Need to take some more medicine. <coughs> Sorry about that. I'm still trying to look for that Titanoboa and my big bath. Did it eat my big bath? If it did, it's, that's a whole new problem. I'm killing it. I'm over killing it. Like, I usually never see titanium bows. After I went on like a full-fledged war on titanium bows, I like, never come again. And then just a titanium bow pops out of nowhere and kills my big bat and a bunch of leeches pop out of nowhere what's going on over here my main pretty much concern is finding that titana bow and murdering it ripping its head off titana bow is kind of and the sarco comes up the most action I've ever gotten is a Diplosaurus over there and it didn't attack me and I came over and shot it. That's the most action I've ever gotten. That's not true. I fought a Stingray where they met good on. But, again, they don't attack me. I attack them. It's 
also Titanoboa popping up out of nowhere and killing my um, big bet. That's not normal. More leeches. Oh, that one's moving fast. Holy crap, three leeches? Ah, oh, dang it, there's a leech on me. This is a really quick way of getting both those. If you which that's what I want. And a lot of chitin. Chitin is also given. And you get leech blood. Um I know it gives you um I know it like makes you be able to do some things. Like makes you have medicine I think to cure diseases like the leeches give you but I actually haven't learned it yet and I don't know when you will learn it and I don't know what it's called so leave it in the comments below if you know what it is and like how I can like, use it how I can use leech blood because I have a lot of leech blood blood I mean I don't have a lot of leech blood it's it's bud light for leeches oh and also if you are trying to like jump on a rock to get away from or just you're stuck or something but you're out of stamina let me I just want to get my stamina out. I just saw a bunch of leeches. Where'd they all go? I bet I have at least a hundred. So, right? There's no more leeches on the beach. Better. A uh, 67? Yeah, it's better than what I got. Dang it, my stamina comes so fast. I'm just gonna run. Try to attract leeches so they'll come after me. Is that leech poop? Really? I didn't even know leeches could be. Nope! Never mind, it's my poop. It just looks so small. It could be a leech's poop. There's some leeches over here. I know there's some titanoboas over here. I'll kill those. Hey, titanoboa. Oh. Alright. I don't know about these, but you know what? Should I tame it? I'll tame it if. Dang it, I want to kill this Dibba Smurfs quickly. Guys, <laughs> swords are amazing. And these things I've heard on the They're in Scorched Earth, and they are the Brontos. They're, they're only better than Brontos. It'll just pull out stone arrows because it, it's a, that's a really smart mechanic. Because I'm trying to decide what this eats. Like if it eats meat. Oh, I just realized I also got a bunch of oil. I'm an idiot. Oh, leeches also give oil. Leeches and trilobites also give oil. And, because I don't think it eats meat, 
if that dipper's voice comes out from me, I'll screw you. <laughs> Something more important in your life. Can I not pick up? Oh, there it is. I'm trying to get berries. I get a lot of berries. Phew! Excuse me. Sorry, I didn't mute my mic. Yeah, he definitely eats berries. What is his weight? That weight for just now being that is actually really good. What's his what's his movement speed is alright. His melee damage is alright. Let me check my melee damage. My melee damage is 100, and I can almost take out, I can take out a t normal T-Rex with just my sword. Ah, uh, dang. That's got good. Good, good, good. I'm still figuring out what leech blood is, though. But, I have a good 67. How long does it take? To be tamed. I got Leah the Giant. Sadly, y'all didn't get to see Big Beth. Big Beth has, has died. As you saw from the tragedy, screw you. You and your family. <laughs> I don't know, knock down a tree, but I don't like it. Oh, what the heck? I blind tried to hit a defenders. What the heck is that happening? Oh, a titanidor hit me, that's why I'm poisoned. I hope you hit the titanidor. That killed my sweet big Beth so I can shop your head off. I declare war on all titanobers. I need to figure out if it's girl or boy. Oh dude, hold up. Whistle wanna stop this. All right, are you you're a man? I can't name you. I can name you Patrick. Yeah. Hey, what the heck? Run, dude. I'll take care of this with my sword. I hate Titana Bros. They're so annoying and I will always hate them. Don't get a spear at first unless you are on Scorched Earth because they are actually pretty good for killing wolves in Scorched Earth. But let us go. We have to go quickly because this area is the worst. My area is better. Dang it. 
you dare blind me. Don't you dare blind me. dead isn't he as long as he's dead and he's not my problem I am all right with this uh. one two three all it takes is three as easy as one two three and then you're not hungry except for cooked meat uh. fish meat I uh. think that either gives you less or more Oh, you're so cool. I really like you. You got dry skin, which is weird, but that's probably why you're in scorched earth. Yeah, your health is fine. Have I learned how to ride you yet? P. A. R. P A R A P R A Wait, what is it? P A R A C E P A R A C E I guess it's a parser saddle. Thing it takes 18. I will someday ride you, but mainly I need to protect you from danger. And I swear something is attacking my beautiful baby. It's dead. Why do you look hurt? Let me check your health. Let me check everything. No, your health is good. But I do want to get you out of here. Because this is a scary area. Don't you... Mm -hmm, stop as I get closer over here. And I don't know if I'm going to get it. Okay. Oh, that's so and they can just jump out of the water or something. They would have wrecked everything over here. Everything. Oh, and how you get off a Bronto is you don't kill your, you don't drop off your stuff. What you do is you go down to the end of the tail and you gotta position it. <coughs> oh gosh. And they make it. There you go. And if you didn't know this, Brontos are mainly only good for getting a lot of berries, specimen eggs, stuff like that. And Nurka berries. And that's pretty much all they're good for. Not to burst your bubble, they're not good for attacking because their thing will normally hit one way. And They, they don't move very fast. I have seen an Alpha T-Rex fight one. It lost pretty badly. Like I'm not even gonna lie, it lost pretty badly. I'm gonna throw this leech blood in here. All right, I'm gonna throw my leech blood in over here. And soon I'm gonna learn how to make like things with bleach blood. Bleach. Nothing. Sorry guys for the long videos in ARC, but... ARC, it's a long game. One second. Sorry about this. 
my actual um, controller is about to die, so I need to charge it, actually. Let me go back into ARC. Like, the game will mess up sometimes. Say, like, it's more stuff. Er, it, it won't do what I want to do. So, what I'm trying to find right now is, I have, is this it? Yeah, this is it. And my other one's out there. So, there we go. Sorry for the wait. But, I can get, come on, get in there. There we go, check. Sorry about that. Hey, my friend is on. How about that? So, I guess that's, that's a good tips and tricks video for today. I will run back to my base one time and I will, um, I guess I will see, I will show you how to get electronics. Is it charging or not? There we go, okay. I am so sorry for so much in and out. I'm checking if my battery is charging or not. But I'm gonna run back up to this mountain real quick. Hopefully I don't run into a T-Rex. Uh, I've had nasty encounters with that. I keep running into T-Rexes, so. Yeah. The best thing you can actually do, like when you um, are trapped on another island and your bird dies, is if you don't have a bed, which I did, but I would have to walk all the way over there and if it dropped, my stuff is go hit a tree. Go die. I can hear something moving. I actually tried to do a pipeline because I'm an idiot. And, um, and my base is so far away from water. I thought maybe I could get it like halfway or something. And then like, I wouldn't have to go all the way. Like you go to like the bottom of the mountain, get some, run back up. Like I wouldn't need, even need to fly too far away from my base. I'd have to fly down the mountain and then I have water. Yes, I'm gonna see some angry guys. Don't worry, they're not gonna kill me. Hey, I don't usually see trikes down here. Hi, trike. Oh, Dido. Dido. I, I, I'm hoping for rain. I'm so badly hoping for rain right now. I really, really need rain. Rain, if y'all did not know, is another tip. Um, you can actually, it actually refills your water. You can get a water reserve, and you might say that's what you're using. No, it'll actually refill your water on your own, and that's like, that's how you, that's how you refill your water. You fill it with that. Or, like, uh, like when you're on a mountain, that's, that's usually my source of... I don't, like, always go to the end of the end hill. I need to throw all of this in here. Some of that cutting. I think I'm able to get a lot more stuff now. Yeah. I'm finally able to get 22 electronics. Yeah, I'm gonna get 22 electronics for 
because electronics are so very annoying to get. Oh, and the grill, uh, that's the first thing you should ever get when you are getting, when you get your fabricator working, the grill is the first thing you will need to get. Go to, in the updated version, you will need to go to, um, sorry, you will need to go to, Oh, for industrial girl. Um, go to advanced for the um settings. And um go down and it will eventually say harvest amount. You're gonna want to turn that to depending on what you're getting. If you're going for the industrial refinery forge and it's depending on what your things are and what your previous harvest amount was on, you're gonna wanna go on 14. But that is really high. Hitting a tree a couple of times with an ax might you get you uncovered. It's really high. The good amount, which is still pretty high, but it's, it, it's a decent amount. It still gives you good amounts of stuff, and it lets you be able to get a lot of stuff in the smithy and the fabricator. It's seven half of 14 so like all that metal i got these rocks on the very first one i actually mined them on the very first level of harvesting and they still give it a crap ton so these rocks are still amazing they will always be amazing but you also have to remember that the special rocks are not special rocks in the refinery forges and industrial forge they will only give you half if you have a 200 of metal which you probably won't carry i will i'm level 85 i think and i have upgraded weight for a long time i can hold two stacks of 200 and some other and everything in my hot bar and some more stuff like this carrot and chitin I mean so um yeah definitely want to take like if you uh, want to live on a mountain or you're just going on a mountain and you want to tame something real quick my suggestions are a stego the reason is he can move around better than a bronto will attack better than a Bronto, just in case you get into combat while you're getting some metal or crystal at the top of the mountain, at most top of the mountains. Um, and most likely Karno. Again, it's got the strength, it's got the speed, and it's good for combat. And it's got the weight. So, take these two. I, I had Argentavises I took before this, but they both died. That is okay. As long as you don't carry too much, and you can ride your Carno, or you just want him by your side while you make it down, you're gonna wanna take these two, go on a bunch of metal runs, come back down, drop them off at your base, keep going. That's how I got all of my stuff, and I'm about to pass out, and I will die. So. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go die pretty much. Because I'm not gonna make it to water in time. Dang it. How did I not die from that? That that's weird. I need that to go away quickly though, or I will not be able to make it to water. get up my stamina also upgrade stamina and the only reason I'm going to water right now and not doing a, the final thing I want to show you is why it's so long 
I'm actually gonna tell you to skip to, let's say, five, 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 and I will be doing electronics. So five, uh, 55 minutes and 25 seconds should be about the time that, uh, no, it will be. So skip to five, so 55, uh, I can't speak, y'all know what time. One second. So if you're still watching, I'll just say a couple of things, not very important things. The beaches, they're filled with the bull sources and donuts. If you're trying to get some quick meat, just go down here. If you're looking for a Megalodon or Stingray, you want to ride, just come down here. The ocean is filled with so much stuff, including water, which is used for practically everything. I am going to try and keep that promise though of making it to 525, 5525. So I'm gonna need to get up my stamina and start running. Hopefully my water is not all wasted and I need to bring my water jar down here. Oh wait, I died. I will need to make a new water jar though. Water jars are actually very useful if you have a lot of weight and you're only going to get water. So, at 25, I gotta make it to my base quickly actually, if I wanna keep up with that time. So this mm. might be a little bit difficult to keep it at the time, but I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try team, I'm gonna try. I gotta get my stamina back. I don't have much time. And what I'm gonna do is probably just talk. Um, for a minute to go. If, like I make it there before, which I'm going to actually, because my base is right here. So I'll just talk some few tiny, tiny tips that might help you. <gasps> Having good player damage, that's always useful. You gotta have that in some cases. Why did I leave that on? I am sorry about that. Let me grab that. So, like this. It actually takes outlets. I got so confused about this. I was launching cord cables everywhere. As you can see, there's a cable literally going through my generator. But what you need is, pretty much all you need is incline cables and straight cables. And maybe turn cables. Maybe. I have a good one. So, what you're gonna do is you're just gonna grab the cables Put the cable on this, but first you're going to put the outlet, which is this. Oh, why is this? That's a problem. This little thing right here is the electrical outlet. You might want to take a picture of that so you remember exactly what it is. Now, it's going to take some electronics three to be precise this whole video i didn't make it for this but my main goal was that i could make some, enough electronics to do this i only need three of these that's all i need and then, three, I'll still have 19 electronics left over. So, I'm looking for anything with 19. Up. I could probably get the vault.
The fabricated pistol is good, but I would not advise you to get it unless you have a lot of gunpowder and you like fast firing weapons that are not that strong. Sorry about that. So, now it is five, I missed a little bit of time, but it's 55, a little past 25. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn on the fabricator. We have electronics. We're going to make one, two, three. So you can make a fridge. Fridges are very useful. I do not need a fridge this moment. What I need is and one of these. Let's see if we're going to grab the outlet and all right so if you can see there's a little green thing down there I'm not looking for the green thing to be at the bottom I want it up more at the top is very close to an hour long. So, what I'm trying to do, ah, that's what it is. So, what you do is take your cable, do that, and then place your electric outlet. There we go. That's how it works. On that. Okay. Okay. Then. The refrigerator is good for holding meat. It keeps your meat from ever spoiling. So. Pretty amazing. Uh. Dang it. Oh, and don't, don't say you'll never need gas. Gas is the power of the generator, but it only makes you need it for one thing to be powered on. So, yeah. and you can turn on and off things from the inside of it. This is actually like kind of a little confusing because you got them, you gotta get them right, or we gotta screw it up, and then we gotta screw it up. So, just got that setting go. Mm -hmm. 
see, like, now I have full water because it's wet. It's very useful. Still give me the option, or there's going to be a problem. Here. There's a problem. Here. Why is nothing being powered? Powered. everything so minting paste all right i'll see y'all in the next video uh